Hi, yes, hello, and welcome back to the Millennial Movie Member Request. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley, and if you're a returner, welcome back. I'm a millennial that likes to go back and watch your older classic movies for the very first time. That's on Mondays. On Fridays, my top tier patrons, my Millennial Movie Members, can pick any movie of any year, of any genre, and I gotta watch it. Now, if you're just now finding me, just know I'm working my way through the MCU. We're about to start the TV series coming up soon, but there were some X-Men movies some information from the X-Men films that I need in my back pocket when I continue through Marvel. Now, if you want to see my Marvel playlist, it's up here in one of these corners. And if you want to see all the X-Men movies I've seen, I will link that up here in one of the corners as well. But today, if you haven't seen the title or read the thumbnail, I'm watching the 2013 The Wolverine. Now, the last movie we watched, I got all the backstories for Xavier, Magneto, I got Mystique. Are you kidding? Also, 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 Jennifer Lawrence. I really love seeing her. So, um, if you know anything about me, I do love a good backstory about how people became who they are. So, that answered so many questions for me the past movie. Um, now, I'm really hoping that since this title is The Wolverine, I'm really hoping that we get to see a little bit more of how The Wolverine came to be the Wolverine. We've gotten some glimpses, like we know now that the metal skeleton, he wasn't born with the metal skeleton, He his mutation is the rapid healing. And so we've gotten some glimpses, some, some flashbacks, some stuff here and there, but I'm hoping with the title literally being The Wolverine, I'm hoping that we're gonna get I'm hoping for a full backstory with this movie, but I don't know if that's what I'm gonna get. So anyways, no more diddle dallying. let's get right on into today's Millennial Movie Member Request, which is the 2013 The Wolverine. Okay, that is beautiful. I don't know where that is, but I would like to go to there. Not if the scary alarms are going to be going off. <laughs> Whoa. Um. Oh, not the claws being bones. Don't like that. So that's before he became Metal Skeleton. Got it. Oh. Um, this wasn't what I was expecting to see first thing. Can tell you that. My guy, if you're gonna do it, I would just go ahead and do it because I ain't trying to see that happen. You know what I mean? Oh my God, could you imagine? I would simply, I would simply be shitting myself. You might want to move or something. I don't know how long it takes for bomb things to get to places, but you are running out of time to do something. <laughs> oh my God, you know, oh Lord, you know Wolverine about to be burnt to a crisp. Do I even want to see him? Do I even? Nah, nah, nah. I didn't want to see him. I didn't want to see him anymore. <laughs> Oh my lord, could you imagine the pain going through it and then healing from it? Wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up. Oh, it was a nightmare. Okay. Where were you? Hey, Jane! You're supposed to be dead, girlfriend. Of course. Can you stay? Oh, she's not. Okay, she's dead. She's dead. I made a vow. A solemn vow. You're making fun of me. I would hate to wake up from that kind of nightmare. Wake up into another one. No! No, jeez! No! <sighs> okay, so this takes place after the Dark Phoenix. After she became the Dark Phoenix and like, you know, he had to kill her, obviously. Hence the nightmare. I guess in this moment I'm a little confused how we ended up in the woods and school. Grug, scruffy, scruggly. Hey, 
What? Oh. Y'all just shooting up in the air? Scare the crap out of me. Um, sounds like the bear is the one doing the hunting. That's what it sounds like. Oh no. He's not dead yet. Oh, I hate this. One arrow took down that big old bear? One? I know, I know it ended his suffering, but that doesn't make sense any easier. Got it, you got Eddie. You know, if I watched my friends get mauled to death by a bear, I wouldn't just leave and go to the bar. Tell you that. And that's a poison broadhead, which last I heard was illegal. Like, like they put poison on the arrow? That hurt. Okay, that was kind of badass. That was kind of badass. Most of them would I seen anyway. Ah. Without your help. So is she also a mutant and can't see the future? It was named Danza by the first samurai who used it. Danza means separator in Japanese. Appropriate name for a sword. Okay, to cut through that stool like no problem. That's a badass sword. I've been trying to find you for over a year. Why? To give you that. He kind of has six of his own, you know what I mean? All right, where is he? Tokyo. I'm not going to Japan. Vacation! You are a soldier. No, not pull over. You are a soldier. Pull over now. I wouldn't want to argue with somebody who's got that sword and the way she kicked ass in the bar. And you seek what all soldiers do. And what's that? An honorable death. An end to your pain. Are you offering... to die? A man who has nightmares. Every night of his life, he's in pain. How'd she know that? 15 hours, depending on the wind. Woo way! I have a deep fear of using the bathroom on airplanes. I have never done it. And I hope to never do it. So I don't know if I could handle a 15 hour flight. Especially not a flight with that kind of turbulence. That kind of turbulence I ain't gotta worry about up and getting, uh, like I ain't gotta worry about getting up and going to the bathroom. I'm gonna shit myself right there in my seat. Could he? So he's gonna go back and help this guy. This is who we're gonna go see. And the family business became Japan's largest. Wow, I'll give you a little card to memorize. Okay, you don't have to be mean. I you must have shit on my life. Don't be a dick. Thank you. I agree with her. Don't be a dick. They've grown strong as the government has grown weak. <laughs> oh, listen, that man's gonna set off, set off some <laughs> metal detectors. Let me tell you that. His whole skeleton is metal. Shinge, Master Yashida's son. Wow. He's good. I would say so. Well, girl, be careful. That's a whole medical facility. You don't want to be knocking anything over. Oh, wow. She's so pretty. <laughs> Who is the caveman? OMG. He looks like Arthur from uh, Red Dead Redemption when I used to go to the bathhouses in the game. He looks so good. You clean, handsome. Nothing like a caveman anymore. Uh-uh, uh-uh, I'm still not over you and Jean. So you cannot be over you and Jean. Whoa! Can we talk about that hospital bed? That is some Wakanda technology right there, swear. Dr. Green, leave us. Nope, you cannot go from a Dr. Gray to a Dr. Green. You cannot do that, I will not allow it. Eternity can be a curse. Are you offering to kill him? We have reason to believe that your ability to heal can be passed. Transferred? Passed from you to another. To who? What do they need with it? I'm not ready to die now. Oh, you want the mutation. Nice to see you again. Sorry you got sick. Please. Damn, what an exit. What an exit. Sorry about your luck. Bye. <laughs> Tokyo, Hitaka. 
for him to die? It is time for him to die? But it's important! Okay, I don't like the sun. Something tells me he's the one that's gonna kill everybody. Oh! No one's gonna say nothing. Nobody's gonna step up. How is Wolverine just watching that happen? That's my question. Ooh! Careful. Well, somebody else can't kill you if you do it to yourself first, I guess. Okay, so the sun, whatever happens, the sun is definitely behind it. Calling that right now. You have always been my assumed successor. Oh, plot twist is coming. I now realize that was a mistake. Oh. Well, now I know why he was trying to kill his daughter, his literal own daughter. Because she's going to take over the company and he's butthurt about it. That's not Jean. <laughs> What the hell was that? Who the hell was that? Okay, love those shoes. That's how the doctor shows up to the to the wake? Okay, Miss Thing. So I feel like this is a big trap and I don't like it anymore. But then he was always fascinated with your kind. Okay, rude way to put that. Time for you to go back to your cave. Did dude leave the factory and business to Logan? I thought it was gonna be Marigold, but did he leave it to Logan? What? What? I don't understand. Why is that bad? Oh, is in a in is in a an um, um an attempt is gonna happen now, currently? Oh, dang! Okay, well, zero to a hundred real quick. Okay, I love her. I want to be her. I want to embody her badassery. I love her. Ma'am! Ma'am! Why? Um, um, um. I have so many questions. Yeah, he doesn't need help. Wanna be Hawkeye? Who is on whose side at this point? Like, is it the sun? Who are these people? Are they even related to the sun? I just have so many questions. Is it just me or is this movie like a lot more blood than previous X-Men movies? Like, there's blood splatter everywhere in this film. Wow, that precision though, couldn't be me. Again, it's a lot of blood splatter this time, isn't it? Did they have a new director? <laughs> Through the door? Through the door? Oh, heavens. Okay. Those were Yakuza. I'm fine. Why are they after you? I'm fine. Okay, but why were they after you? What? Are you getting the heck out of Dodge or are you going back to the house? Oh. oh. You only thought you were alone. What did they do, like 300 miles an hour? Is that for real? Is that for real? <laughs> <laughs> the stranger! Last I saw, he was protecting your daughter. Boom roasted. You are a toy doll. A companion for a child who has outgrown you. Okay, well that's enough to make me want to cry. You want to be left alone? Yes. I understand. Do you? Oh yeah. <laughs> I miss if I do that, I don't think you're gonna live to see the end of the day. Yeah, do you want to be sassy with the one man who stuck by you and saved your life? Are you not healing? Is he not healing? Did Lizard Tongue Lady do something to him? If that train is going 300 miles an hour and he's... Oh my god, okay. Oh my god, Logan, get your ass back in the train! Oh! 
I literally could not watch that, okay? I, c I could not watch that. This has given me anxiety. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like that Wolverine can't see. Oh God, what do we do now? Oh! I Meanwhile, well, I can't even do a push up, so I would not have lived through this at all. What happened to you? We got I saved your life yet again, girl. I gotta figure out why he's limping, why he ain't healing. I'm big worried about Logan right now. Good. We're staying here. Okay, that is a fun hotel. The little cubes and such. Oh, what? I love hotel. Oh, like a romantic hotel. She's asking if he prefer the dungeon, the nurse's office, or the mission to Mars. Uh, well, considering Logan's condition, I would go with the nurse's office. Oh, okay, y'all went with the mission to Mars, giving a little total recall moment, gotcha. Wow, it is a moon bed. Fun. Where do you plan on sleeping? I don't. My guy, for the first time in your life, you are wounded. Something tells me you need your sleep. Just let it go. It's not hard to die. I was gonna say, you gotta be doing bad if you're having these hallucinations and you're awake and it's not a nightmare, you know? So, maybe you should go to the doctor. Ah! Freaking out! Freaking out! You're slipping. Uh. Not Jean saying she's he's slipping. <laughs> Is girlfriend upstairs fighting back? Girlfriend upstairs fight back with the Mars room thing. <laughs> Okay, girl can throw. Okay, we have got to get Logan to the hospital. Is that a goat? It is a goat. Are we having an underground surgery right now? Are we not in a real hospital? Well, something tells me a real hospital wouldn't have a goat in it, so yeah, probably. You see a doctor? In a manner of speaking, yes. He's a veterinarian. Hey, better than just some random guy off the street. I never needed this before. I know, I'm freaking out. Your grandfather told me my healing could be taken from me, passed on. Oh my God, did he do it while, did she do it while he was asleep and give it to him and he like, he's gonna fake his own death? The old man? Okay, so she can kill people with a kiss. All right, well. Oh, Logan, before you open it to say one more Oh, no, the fingernails too. What is she? What is her mutation? He's just a man now. His flesh is weak now. I did that. Tell me who you are and what you've done. You know what, girl? I'm gonna say I agree with you. I don't think they're gonna come looking for you in this kind of house. Monica, why did your father hit you? There's a good question. When they read his will, I will become the most powerful person in Japan. I told you! I don't understand why he gave it to me. Because he trusts you, girl! My father arranged it last year. What? It gives me better access to the political theater. Boo! Bad reason to marry! God! Jeez Louise! Hugh Jackman got some veiny arms! He be drinking his water, he is on top of his cardiovascular health! Oh, oh yeah, oh, the flashback to the war, got it. Oh, this was your tunnel? This was your tomb? This was your lair? I just simply don't have the upper body strength to get out of there. I couldn't do it. Oh, wow. Wow, to be there all these years later to see it totally different. Who's Jean? Oh, girl. Boy, howdy. Could we tell you some stories? Okay, I love that. I'm going to assume that it's a kimono. Maybe not a robe, but a kimono that she has on. Beautiful. 
happy. Oh, shut up. Now would be an awful time to have a hallucination of Jean. <laughs> oh. Ah, speaking of which. Woo! Jesus Christ! Oh, don't stab her! <laughs> she is so calm right now, and I simply would not be. I killed her. Okay, but don't just say it like that. Like, give more context, or you sound like you just murdered her in cold blood, and you didn't. Y'all got time. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> well, be careful! You can break your legs now! I saw you die. Okay, how did, how did it happen? It's you on your back. There's blood everywhere. You're holding your own heart in your hand. What? When I was five, I knew how my own parents would die. Oh, well that is awful. I hope you got therapy. A lot of people have tried to kill me and I'm still here. Yeah, but you're different now, aren't you? Yeah, you're taking wounds, my guy. And if you can take wounds, you can take death. <gasps> is this a fiance? Is this? Oh my heavens, I had no idea. Oh, well wait, they did say it was an arranged marriage earlier. Now call me old fashioned, but I thought being engaged meant you were done with this kind of bullshit. Boom, boom. What I could do to you, really? You gonna try and talk tough standing there in your red underwear? <laughs> Damn. 10 words to explain to me would want your fiance killed by the Yakuza. You don't have the faintest idea of what's going on. So you gonna try again with 10 words? How many words was that? Nine. Nine. One word? That's right. Wait, wait. No! You wanted the truth! I told you the truth! Aww, you threw that man over and him red undies? Oh, he landed in the pool. Still embarrassing, but... You really want to run away from the guy with the sword? Acting as if people are in on this? Oh, damn. Broke his, broke his neck right then and there. <laughs> Help you in your pain? Mutation? A viper? Oh my god, she poisoned the pin, then stabbed him with it. Oh, she took the medical bugs. <gasps> One of the medical bugs is in you! Not with that thing inside me. You're going to die, Logan. Maybe that's okay. Uh oh my god. Hey, somebody's behind! Somebody's outside! Oh my god, I am stret. <laughs> oh. 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 Hey, we needed that! We needed to see what we were doing! Uh. 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 Disgusting! That is so gross, but now you got an open hole in your torso! Ah! <gasps> Did he slice her face? <gasps> the bug was what was making him not be able to heal himself? Too much going on in tiny space. I need somebody to calm down. through him no way no way
So, does this mean, like, dude could cut his arm off and his arm would grow back? Like, could he regenerate that much of his body? What kind of monster are you? The Wolverine. Could you imagine having to pull that sword out of yourself? I granted his dying wish. I helped him rest. Now it's your turn. What? Huh? Is she good or bad? She has to be bad, right? At this point, like, that's just known. She's not good. Right? I'm gonna say right. I'm gonna say she bad. She will be fine. So long as you do your job. There are so many double agents and things, and I just don't know who to trust anymore. Oh, wow. Silver Samurai. Oh, um, it's already working. We are grateful for your protection of Mariko, but there is one more sacrifice you must make for her family. Go fuck you yourself, pretty boy. Oh my god. There's so much more blood and profanity in this movie. I'm not offended. I'm just saying it's a stark difference from the previous X-Men films I've watched. I'm just starting to wonder if they had a different director or something. Yeah! You know what? Never would have thought to use a net. Never would have thought to use a net. Am I watching Pulp Fiction in X-Men form? That's what I feel like I'm watching! <laughs> and he lit the cigar with the explosion. Good lord. Oh, heavens, that's a lot of... <gasps> Are these the dipped arrows? Are these the dipped arrows? I forgot about it. I forgot. I was too intrigued by the arrow on the string. Okay, well, even if the ones on the strings are not poisoned, that one definitely was. That's fine. I guess he went from the Wolverine to the porcupine, am I right? But um, tsk. <laughs> it's okay. I hate me too. Impressive, no? He's made of adamantium, just like you. Oh! Okay, real question that's not really important to this movie per se, but are katanas really sharp enough to be able to chop through metal like that? So is the Silver Samurai a full robot? Oh, and now you're like trying to hit on her? Also, she doesn't even know that her arranged fiance was found in a hotel room with two other women. <laughs> yes, girl, love her! Love her. Holy shit, that's a big blade! You're gonna declaw him? Stop! <laughs> That's big risky on her part. Ugh, why was she screeching like that? So many things! I just, it's a lot happening all at once! What made you think that big man, big robot man, would not survive a fall? And this bitch is taking her skin off. There are so many. And her hair. 
Wow. Okay. Okay. Um. I get it. A viper reptile so she can shed her skin. I just never saw it coming that she was going to take her skin off. This is not the way. I think it's the only way he's got, buddy. I think he's already been determined. I think that's, I, well, uh. Do it, do it, stop waiting, do it. There you go. The separator. I mean, if the claws are bones and he can heal himself, then I would say that they would grow back, but then they wouldn't be covered in the metal. Jesus bless America! Is that all she's got is spit? Is that the best you got? Oh, oh, oh heavens, okay. Oh, that is... He's really getting to the bone! Is there a human? Don't look so shocked. What? You know I'm giving you the very death you longed for. <laughs> I just, I just, I just, it's so much. <gasps> because she's a knife thrower, so she's a bunch She did it! Yes! Oh, his claws, everything. Okay, he's healing himself. All right, so he's good to go. He's doing great. That guy, robot man, not doing good. Ah, I have my question answered. They, the bone grew back and it was not covered in metal. <laughs> you all right? Man, what a day. Jean. Now's not the time. And it's over? All right. I read online that there is an in credit scene, so that's what we're gonna do. Hi. Yes, hello. This is next day, Ashley. I was organizing files. I just got done at the gym. Like, I was not gonna film today. But while I was organizing the files, I realized that there may not have been an end credit scene, but there definitely was a mid credit scene. So we're gonna watch that together now. Anyways. Two years later, okay. I need you to do something about that hair, baby. Um, does nobody else notice that going on? You can go ahead, sir. All right. Hey, baby. Hey, Magneto. I want, I want your help. Why would I trust you? You wouldn't. <laughs> At least he knows that. Time is frozen. Time is frozen. So does that mean Xavier's here? Hey, buddy. Hey, hey friend. What are you, I thought you were dead. I told you a long time ago. You're not the only one with gifts. And the credits start again. Okay, so. Um, okay, so, um. If this is after, if this is after Wolverine killing the Dark Phoenix, 
And we remember the Dark Phoenix basically kind of, sort of, not really, but kind of pulled a Thanos and snapped Xavier out of commission. And then also, you know, Magneto, his powers were taken away. But y'all did point out that I was talking and I missed a moment where his hand was like, he was big focused, you know. I missed a moment where it moved a little bit. So I guess if this is two years later, Magneto's powers are back and now Professor Exit, like, he's back? And, you know, also, what is up with the really, the stupid ass line he just said where he was like, you're not the only one that has powers. Like, my guy, we've been knowing this for a few movies now. Are we to assume that now you have the power to just come back to life? Anyways, all right. Go into outro, Ashley, having not watched this in credit scene. But we just shared a moment. Look, we kind of do it. Listen. Oh, M.G. Listen. Xavier ain't the only one who can time travel. We can't. Well, me. Not you. Me. I be time traveling. Anyway, okay. Here's outro, Ashley. Wolverine outro. Let me tell y'all something. These fight scenes in this movie... Number one, the fight scenes were amazing, but I do want to go back and say that I feel like this movie had a lot more blood in it than the previous X-Men movies. I could be wrong, but I don't know why I would have noticed that in this movie and not the other ones. Um, uh, who was Green Lizard Lady Bitch? She was wild. Shedding her skin? Insane. Um, the tongue thing? Weird. Her death? crazy. I feel like just this movie, I mean, listen, blood and stuff doesn't gross me out, so I'm not complaining. It's not a negative. I just feel like other X-Men movies were not this graphic, and, like, seeing her being strung up and then and a bit neck lady over there. Anyways, um, wild that the grandfather wasn't dead and you wonder what's wild is i actually when they were removing his body from from the from the place at the beginning or close to the beginning and they didn't have his face covered i thought that was kind of weird because you know here and well and it could be a japanese culture thing but here in america like when somebody kicks the bucket and you're wheeling them down the hallway or whatever you just kind of covered him up because they big dead he was not big dead or he was not covered up he was laying there like this he was still open you know what i mean so that was weird um, I don't know why I never thought about those little bug things being inside of Wolverine. I really thought it was like her spit or something that like took the thing, like took his powers from him or whatever. Um, wild. This movie was wild. Big wild. Um, fight scenes were awesome. I love how, okay, I was calling her Marigold and that wasn't her name. It was, it was K-O. I thought it was gold. It wasn't. It was Mariko? I, I could be saying the wrong. Anyways, she turned out, never would I have thought that, like, her, I thought the knife throwing story and the camp story was just to tie her with Archer Man, but then she was the one that actually took down her own grandfather, and the grandfather was the one that left her the company. Also, like, why would he, why would the grandfather cause such a big stink with his son and his granddaughter just for him to be like, surprise, bitch, you know what I mean? Like, what was his plan to reappear into society maybe okay i think i'm asking questions that aren't important to this movie um you know it wasn't the you know we got a little bit more of the backstory about him serving um in wars many many wars because dude's been around for a hot second hundreds of years and um anyways but it still just wasn't the full backstory. I want to find out why he agreed to have the metal put into him. Because another movie we watched is that he volunteered for it, you know? And now he... So now he's got his bones exposed. Oh my god, that was... Okay, so gross. So gross. The the drills. Oh my god, can we talk about the wood chipper thing? And just the bodies being chopped up and... Spe I'm not kidding. It was the most graphic X-Men movie I feel like I've watched thus far. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I just feel like it was, okay? But that doesn't mean I dislike the movie. I, plot twist, after plot twist, I couldn't figure out who was working for who for how long. The Wolverine 2013, five out of five stars. Awesome action, fun new characters, added to the backstory, but not full backstory, five out of five stars. John, thank you so much for getting me started on this crazy adventure you have me on. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, stick around, because coming up Monday, in honor of Alan Arkin, we are watching Little Miss Sunshine. Links to social media down below if you want to be my friend outside the YouTube-averse, and I'll see you right back here on Monday. Bye.